I got to tell you, when I was asked to do this, it was real easy to say yes. And I'm not saying it because I was part of the event. Somebody tells you, Don Mattingly and Brian Leach, it's easy. Not just because they're two great players, but fortunately, I was fortunate enough to know them you know, as people when they were playing. And the two great guys, easy guys, gentlemen, besides being New York icons. That said, I thought they were extremely charismatic. Donnie was, both of them were funny, and I thought the fans really responded. And I, I think the fans are walking out of here tonight with almost probably a better feeling than they even expected that they would have. I thought it was a great night. I thought it was a home run, if you will. You know, in a setting like this, you get to talk, and, you, and your personality gets to come out. And you're not really guarded from the standpoint of that, you know, with the media. When you're talking in public about your club or your organization, uh, it's really got to be careful what you say about anybody or anything. And uh, in this setting, even though you're still going to be honest, you can be a little more relaxed over time and, and uh, just the easier setting. But I know guys all have the same background. You know, I think athletes and kind of musicians and people that travel that are on the road and they're doing stuff, they all have that same feel because they're up on stage, they got people on them, you're traveling a lot, you're city to city. So, and they're. And guys that have been good and like you know a guy like Brian who's, he has that greatness in him it's always the same story if you hear the stories they're all the same they love playing they love being involved they you know if it no matter what industry it is it's like they love music they love sports they love writing they love whatever they do they love it you know and it, I think it's all you always get the same stories and I love, I love that yeah it was fun for me I've never done anything like this before and I got asked a few months ago and you know, usually, I don't know, my kid's schedule or something, but uh, it said, Don Madeline, you want to do an event with Don Madeline? I said, absolutely, I, I am definitely going to do this. I grew up a Yankee fan in Connecticut, and I uh, loved watching Donnie, you know, through the 80s and when I was here in New York uh, through the early 90s. So uh, this was fun. He's as good a guy as I anticipated him being, so it was fun. But I've never really been to a situation where you just talk about you know your career and especially next to someone that I looked up to so uh, that was a big draw for me definitely from from talking to everybody when they came through they seemed to like it and I think the questions were good they weren't just about what happened on the field you know a little bit about your teammates a little bit about the locker room and I think uh, we both tried to give them a little bit different than what quotes in the paper were or something so I think uh, everybody had a good time I'm hoping I'm hoping they did and they seem to say they did on the way through